Alrighty. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to a Slacker Center cover video. I am your robot building host for today, Mad Dog, and this I'm bringing you some more Robocraft, a build episode. Don't forget, guys, if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button, ring that bell, it makes such a lovely sound. Take a bite of that like button, not literally, of course. And please, please, share the content. Help us expand the Slacker's universe. <clears throat> How's it going guys? Mad Dog here with another Joy Robo Building episode. I have gotten inspired again, so without further ado, let's get into creating our new creation. Alright, we're going to build from scratch. <coughs> Sorry, my throat hurts a little bit guys, so bear with me. And we already have mirror mode on, so awesome. We don't have to push it, but don't forget guys, mirror mode is your best friend. Let's go down the list of items we're going to need. We're going to need various heavy to medium cubes of different sizes and shapes. Uh, for movement, we're going to be using the T3 tank, uh, tank treads and the, <coughs> the T2 steering skis. So it's been a while since we had a steering ski on a robot, so I figured I wanted to revisit that and do a good design on it. As for weaponry, uh, we're going to do the T4 Teslas and we're going to be doing the... We're either going to do a two legendary... There they are. The two legendary lasers right here. Or we're going to be doing these T5 Seekers. So, we're going to see what fits. And proceed from there. And then, of course, a bunch of happy little shields. I'm going to definitely put some happy little shields on this design. And for cosmetic parts, I'm not sure if I'm going to add any this time. Might add some of these blades because of the design I'm doing here. Maybe we'll. Ooh, the, we'll definitely add that vapor trail of a snowflake. Because that'll match perfectly. Maybe even that flag. We'll see. We'll see. I'm not sure if any of these cosmetic parts will be useful to us, but we'll also get some smokestacks in there as well. Oh, I also forgot, don't don't worry guys, we're also going to have some, quite a few thrusters on here. Alright, without further ado, let's start off with the tank tracks because we need to make sure we get this correct. For a second, so we can get this in the right spot. There we go. <clears throat> I don't know why, when it goes to mirror mode, it doesn't line them up right. Also, this is off too. I feel like it needs to go to the right one, but whatever. Oh, you know what? Can we actually. No, it does the same thing no matter what, huh? Alright, well, let's just keep it that way. All right, let's get our steering skis. There we go. Oh, sorry, mirror mode. Bam and bam. Now we're gonna just do the three. All right. And we're going to need some heavy cubes here. Because we want these parts to be very strong. Let's go ahead and get Yeah, we'll go ahead and do that. And then some more of those heavy cubes. There we go, I like it. Looks nice. 
<clears throat> there we go. Perfect. Oh, when can I? Okay. I think it was right about here that I wanted to put them. There we go. That looks good. I like it. Alright. And now, connect that right there on the sides. Looks nice. <clears throat> oh yeah, I forgot since, uh... This one's going to be slightly off on the design because of the uh, the tank tracks being weird, but it's all right, guys. Uh, that is going to bother me. And yeah, we'll go ahead and just do that so that way it's even. All right. Wish we could uh, get this centered, but you know, they still haven't fully thought about stuff like that in this game yet, unfortunately, but nothing we can do about that. Alrighty, uh, we need to, that's right, let's get our happy little shields on there. So I want to make sure I do this correct. I did tinker around a little bit to test a similar design, but we're going to do a variation of that. So, all right, so we need this one. So right there. And then we need uh, this one. Sorry, I need the right side one. Nope. The inner one. There we go. That looks good. I like it. And then over here, we need these. Wrong side. There we go. I like it. Yeah. Get some nice, some nice coverage here. I think we could even do that. Uh, left one. Darn. <laughs> Got to be the right one. Yeah, it looks funny, doesn't it? Let's see. That'd be a better one that'll fit in there. Come on, behave you. There we go. Yeah. I like it. Alrighty. We need to come out a little bit more with these heavy cubes. And then, once we are done, we can put our... Let's see. I think that's far enough out. Let's see. Nope, we gotta go out one more layer. One more layer. Yeah, we're gonna call this one Snowplow. It's gonna be nice. Darn.
Nah, I'd rather it all be the same. So let's do one more. One more layer. And then we can put... Okay, let's not start off at the top one. There we go. Yeah, there we go. Now we're talking. All right. So for movement, let's get. <clears throat> let's see if the T fives will fit there now that we had to move that up. No, not quite. Still gonna have to be the T fours. Perfectly happy with that right there. All right, let's get some T2s in here. Help with the... Turning right here. There we go. That looks nice. I like it. And then... help in case we need some reverse thrust. Alright. <clears throat> now we need to start thinking about design here. So let's go ahead and get these medium cubes now because we want to keep, keep the weight relatively down. Alright. That looks nice. I like it. There we go. There we go. That looks nice. I like it. Alrighty. Let's go ahead and get this built. Say about there. Do it about that tall. Yeah, it looks good. I like it. And yeah, I like it. All right, let's go ahead and let's cut that in there. Let's see. I forgot. Let me get the you know what? We need to get a layer down of <clears throat> blocks. Like 
because I don't want all this breaking off so easily. There we go. All right. Now let's get the big T5s, the ones I like. One there, one set there. Another set there. There we go. That looks good. Ooh, actually, that'll block the. Uh, that's okay. We can probably put a laser here in the front. Yeah, one on the top. That'll work. That'll work. Okay. Let's go ahead and fill this in now. We'll do one main section of heavy blocks though. Just to make sure that it's uh, got some strong points in there. There we go. Alright, now we're going to do away with these. Just because... We need that all to be glass, don't we? Alright. <clears throat> with the exception of the top line here. Okay. Glass, where is the glass? pieces there. There we go. <clears throat> and medium pieces there. And there. Nice. Alright, let's get that legendary laser on here, huh? Before we run out of room. Definitely can't have two of them. Okay. Alright, let's go ahead and improvise. There we go. We 
not going to be able to put those there? Darn. Hmm. What to do here? I guess we're going to have to downgrade those. So we need that to connect. Alright, let's do some meter cubes about there. Let's do... There we go. And then we can do that triangle piece there. Perfect. Oh yeah. There we go. I guess we could put engines on the front here. That'll that'll look good. Now is there room for two? There is. Nice. Alright, now, get the T4s, looking good, 1, 2, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, so definitely enough speed now, oh, we could fit two more here. I actually like the way that looks. There we go. Alright, now let's get the snowflake. There we go, that looks great. And then let us Should we put those on? There we go, that'll kind of provide a little bit of uh, damage protection there. Actually, I like the way that looks, so let's just add a bunch of those, huh? Oh yeah. I'll add one there too, just for looks. Eh. Don't want to overdo it. Still need to figure out a place to put the smokestacks. Let's see. Where would those fit nicely? Oh, 
Oh, now that's gonna look cool. I put a second one like that? No, huh? In the way of opening those. Darn. Really cool that it fits there. <laughs> All right, let's see. Nope, I don't think we're gonna be able to fit them anywhere else. Is fine by me. I really like the way this turned out. Yeah, let's give it a test drive real quick. See how it does. Oh, yes. Oh. Oh, maybe it'll redeem itself. Oh, it did. Nice. <laughs> oh, I love that the flames come from below. It's great. Oh, yeah. This works wonderfully. I love it, guys. Alrighty guys, well since this is going to be the snowplow, we need to make it some very beautiful snowy colors. I think I blue? Let's see. That's too dark of a blue. Maybe my Mouse ball is just like, oh no. Nope. Hmm. No, I think I like the other one better. And then we'll do the dark blues. all different shades of blue yes that sounds perfect to me
really like that shade of blue. But yeah, I think those shades will be perfect. All right, everything's painted. Nice. All righty. The only other thing to do is go test it out. So let's save and quit. Also call it snow. Wow. There we go. Alrighty, guys. That's snowplow right there. Let's go ahead and make it. Test it against some AIs first. For once, we didn't make a high CPU robot. You should be proud of us, guys. Kill the enemy team to win. The first team to reach the target total wins. The battle for Tharsis Rift has begun. Yes, I am loving this design. This will do nicely. This will do nicely. up here to heal real quick. Oh, 
Oh yes, I love this design guys. I don't know if it's going to work that well in an actual battle, but <laughs> I'm very happy with that. Yes, guys, that is a beautiful design right there. Beautiful design. Nice. Alrighty, guys. Well, that is all the time I have for today. And, yeah. We'll, uh, we'll go give this thing a solid try against actual players in the next episode. So uh, don't forget to uh, join me as we uh, meet for the day uh, out at the moon. See you next time, Sniper Underground. Arr, arr.